bunch of water falling there, Dad. Yep. Okay, just... It's you, forming, um... Like, let's be very, very careful. Are we there yet? No, we're not there yet. Hey guys, what time is it? Adventure time! Our Adventure time! That was weak. Alright, we gotta do that again. Hey guys, what time is it? Adventure time! Alright, it's adventure time. We're at Craters of the Moon National Park. National Monument. Excuse me. And we're gonna go look at a lava tube. So Craters of the Moon National Monument is an amazing place to visit. They have a wonderful visitor center there where you can look at interactive maps and you can look at how the monument was actually created. They have lots of displays that show the different animals and plants that live there and how it is that they have adapted to live on such a harsh environment like a lava field. The visitor center also has uh, some great displays showing all the different types of lava you never could have guessed how many types of lava there is. And they tell you where this lava came from and its history and where the lava is now. It's actually still out there, believe it or not. We have some new adventurers on this trip. For the first time, making her debut appearance. Mom. We also have... Brooke. Alright guys, Ellie, turn that off right now. Brooke's ready to get out. Uh, you want to get out? No, 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 no. <laughs> Alright, so here's where the visitor center was. Came all the way cave over here. So we're looking at Indian Tunnel Cave. Good thing we got a permit. That is a big old crack. Look at that fissure in the lava. That's awesome. Yeah, there's so many types of lava. It was amazing to see all the different types of lava as we walked along this lava field. There were so many different shapes and colors of rock, all with a similar origin, but varying due to changes in temperature or the rate of the lava flow. Some of our favorites were the rocks where you could see that the lava was once fluid and it had formed ripples and waves that then had become solid. Everywhere we looked, it was like reading a geological storybook. You could see how the lava had cooled, how it had cracked, and new lava had pushed through those cracks to create the myriad of rock shapes and formations. Just seeing all this variety in the lava and imagining what it must have been like when it was hot and molten was really a great treat. Hey, Matthew, don't be throwing rocks, please. Okay. I know that's your favorite pastime, but... Don't run, guys! Yeah. Do you see the lava? You like the lava, Brooke? Oh, no! Is that better, Brooke? Look at that. Isn't that crazy? <laughs> We're almost there. Lava tube's destiny, huh? Oh yeah, that whole thing used to be a lava tube 
and it collapsed. You can see where it, it's got all these breaks in it. Okay, so we're going in the Indian Tunnel Cave. Let's be very, very careful because Alyssa, wait, wait for Dad. Hey, come down carefully, guys. Come here. Step carefully. There's lots of sharp, sharp rocks. Come here, Alyssa. These are awesome. Look at that one, guys. Look at that. It goes all the way through. Whoa, look at that! Yeah. This is pretty awesome. <laughs> a lot of water dripping down in here, actually. I'm surprised it's as wet. This is out in the middle of the desert. Wow. So you can see where this lava tube's collapsed in some spots. Hold them as Wow, look at that wall. Look at the wall of that cave. That's pretty awesome. Look at that again, so I can see how big it was. So tell me what that is, Emma. Yeah, that was a chunk of the ceiling that fell down. It makes you feel a little, uh, nervous about being in here. <laughs> That's where we came from over there. Where did everybody go? Wow. Look at that. Lava tubes are a type of cave made by lava. They form in a few different ways, but the gist of it is this. As lava is flowing, either from a volcano or a fissure underground, the lava near the top of the flow, or the sides, cools down much quicker than the lava in the middle of the flow. This cooling forms a crust on top of the lava flow and insulates the hot molten rock inside. The lava continues to move through the tube as more and more lava flows from the source. As the source stops releasing lava, the level of the lava river in these tunnels goes down until it eventually stops flowing and hardens, leaving a hollow tube cave. I doubt there's rabbits in there. Unless it's the uh, rabbit from Monty Python and the Holy Grail. We better not risk another frontal assault. That rabbit's dynamite. Stay there, Alyssa, where you're safe. Do you like the lava tube? <laughs> Tubular? Was that for dad joke? <clears throat> okay, walk, just walk along the edge. Do rabbits. Do rabbits. I know the rabbits. There's no rabbits in there. Guys, there's no way there's a rabbit in there. You saw some animal go in there? No. We just saw something in. Try turning the light on. It's not an ideal habitat for rabbits. Did you guys see the ceiling? Yeah. How all the lava was dripping and oozing in here? Forming all these drips. And this is a giant crack. Yeah, look at that fissure. That's crazy. Look at how this huge center of this just collapsed. Okay, we got Brook and Toe. And continuing on the lava tube adventure. Although Brooke wants to walk around. But it's not exactly the best baby walking area. Okay, guys, let's keep going. Kids thought they saw a rabbit up there. I don't think there was a rabbit up there. Okay, help Alyssa. Here. 
Alyssa. I'll help Alyssa. Okay. Now carrying two children. Oh, look at that hole, guys. Look at that skylight up there. Where it fell through. Just a minute, I'm busy carrying 80 pounds of... It's oh, heavy. Is that a little chair? That is a nice chair. How does that lava chair feel? It's a good lava chair. Yeah? And a giant hole. Collapse hole. Look at that. It's awesome. Ooh, it's dark in here. Careful, guys. All right, you ready to go, Alyssa? Daylight. This is a tiny, tiny room in here. And at the end, there's a little... duck down. That hole is where we just came from. Now we're headed back out. Let's go. There's our hole. These are markers so you don't get so close. So that's the that's the top of the lava tube we were in. in super deep pit. You guys like that cave? One, two, three. One, two, three. <laughs> okay, crew. Tell me about what we've seen here today, Matthew. Um, I saw like a little shelf thing, and I also saw. A bunch of bird feathers. Some birds living in the caves? Yeah. Ellie, you thought you saw a rabbit. Are you sticking to that claim? Are you sticking to the thought? What no. do you <laughs> <laughs> Emma, what did you think of the lava tube? I thought it was really cool. There were lots of s small stalagmites and on the way to the cave, there was lots of cool plants. Ellie. <laughs> <laughs> Alyssa, like what did you think of the lava tube? <laughs> um, I like, yeah. No, no, no. And it was like a chair. Yeah. <laughs> and there goes Brooke. Come here. I know you want to walk by yourself, but it's dangerous. Hey. Hey, hey. You having fun? <laughs> you like walking by yourself, huh? Yeah. Careful. So, lava tube was very cool. Admittedly a little difficult with five children, but worth it for sure. Are we there yet?